player partners welcome back if you're new welcome take this minute to go ahead and click the subscribe button make sure you hit the notification bell y'all got a special story for girls talk since it's the month of october we're gonna make this a halloween edition i'm gonna tell y'all a scary story about a time i met a fuck boy so if you like this video at any point make sure you give it a big thumbs up Let's jump into the story. It's a couple of summers ago when my best friend was still living out here and it was a random summer night as usual. We was getting into a lot of stuff that summer. And she was like, hey, this guy I'm talking to, he wants to meet up with me so we could chill. And she's like, she doesn't wanna go by herself. He has a friend. I'm like, okay, no big deal. We didn't have plans anyways. We pull up to his address and it was weird because as soon as we got there, he was like, oh, we're not chilling in the house. We're gonna be chilling by the pool. So this is my, my spidey senses are starting to tingle already. You invited her over to chill, but y'all not about to chill in the house? Like, why do we all have to go sit at the pool? Like, I would understand if he was like, you and my friend, can y'all chill at the pool? And like, me and your best friend, we gonna go chill in the house. Then I'd be like, okay, y'all just want some personal time, but no we're all chilling at the pool so me and my best friend we give each other the side eye like we're chilling at the pool we're about to see how long this plays out because we're not about to be here all night we're all walking to the pool it's me my best friend and the guy that she's talking to we're all walking to the pool he's like his friend is gonna come downstairs in a few minutes while we're sitting there we're having small talk he's trying to tell me about his friend oh his friend just got out of jail what red flag number two now now um my spidey senses is on i'm on high alert y'all now the, it's getting real i'm like just got out of jail you want me to talk to a jailbird this night is gonna have to wrap up pretty soon because i'm not trying to entertain this nonsense right but i'm trying to be a good friend his friend walks over starts to have small talk with me and he was young. I'm like, you're really young to have just got out of jail. Like, what the hell are you doing? What's your life? Property manager comes and he's like, the pool is closing. So pretty much everyone that's at the pool, you guys have to go. Me and my best friend are looking at the dude she's talking to like, okay, so are we all about to go upstairs and chill? Like watch a movie? What is the next move? This dude says, oh, let's go sit in my car, huh? Him and my best friend, they walk to his car and I walk to my car and the friend, the jailbird, is walking with me to my car. I don't really need you to walk me to my car. I pretty much know where I park. He decides to sit in my car with me to continue this conversation that's going nowhere because I've already made up my mind. I don't want nothing to do with you. This is where it really gets real, right, Play Upon this. It's a girl and a guy randomly walking down the street and he looks and I guess he knows the girl. He gets out the car to say, hey, what's up? And he threw some extra on it, right? The guy walking with her is like, what? Like, what did you say? Now it's getting real. It's gang banging talk going on back and forth. Hold the brakes. While they're arguing, I'm texting my best friend like, I don't know what's going on, what y'all talking about. But I'm about to leave because shit is getting real on my end over here. And I don't know, bruh. So I'm not about to stay here and entertain the shenanigans he got going on. The guy and the girl that was walking, she's pulling her boyfriend back. And she's like, you know, let's keep walking. It's not a big deal. The jailbird's like, okay, like, I guess the conversation's over. He decides to try to get back in my car. I'm like, no, you can't sit in my car after that. He's like, oh, it's no big deal. He not coming back. I'm in front of my house. Ain't nothing about to go on. Not even five minutes later, I see the same guy walking back. I was like, fuck no, get out my car, right? I push him out of my car. I start my shit and I pull off. But my best friend, she had already texted me. The jailbird is running down the street. What is going on? Where are you at? I told her, I was like, I'm parked at 7-Eleven. You're still trying to ride with me? Meet me at 7-Eleven. My best friend, she walks to my car. She's like, yo, what happened? The jailbirds arguing with some random. They get into it with some random game banging argument. And I kicked his ass out of my car because I wasn't about to have no shenanigans going on with me in the car and him. I don't even know him. She's like, oh, okay, because we were chilling in the car 
and out of nowhere we just see someone running and he's like banging on the car window like in a panic so i didn't know what was going on i promise you he was usain bolt jr play partners because he made it down the street before i can finish sending the text message to my best friend that i was gonna even meet her at 7-eleven that's why she didn't know what was going on my best friend got in the car with me we ended up going to hang out with another one of our best friends and we had so much fun we told him about the story but the jailbird still had the nerve to try to talk to me after that i was like skirt oh no honey that conversation's not going nowhere i swear i blocked him on social media i was like you not having no type of contact with me but yeah player partners you gotta be careful out here. You gotta be able to identify these fuck boys and these fuck girls. When you get those spidey senses tingling and you should get out the situation, listen to those senses because my senses was right. Avoid that nonsense because he had a whole bunch going on. If you like this video at any point in time, if you've ever met a fuck boy or a fuck girl, go ahead and leave it down below in the comments. Thanks for watching. Wrong.